Hey, what's up, everybody? Rich from Streak here, M7 New York. Today we're going to review, these are the Atmosphere 13s. These shoes are releasing uh, 323, box is 190, and color says Atmosphere Gray, Black White, Jordan 13. All right, that's a great box. We'll use uh, this one for review. Uh, just a brief history, the shoe comes out in 97, 98. Tinker Hatfield shoe. Um, they, they model it after a, a, a Black Panther because Mike was known when he was younger as the Black Cat on the court. So um, that's where they, have the, the, they get the theme of the shoe and there's a couple different, there's three, actually three different things that point to that the, the cat. You've got the indentions here on the side panels here for the whiskers. Hologram for the cat eye right there. Should come out. And, um, and then the paw print on the bottom. So that's kind of where the theme comes from for this shoe. You've got a carbon fiber plate here as well. Um, like I said, this is called Atmosphere Gray. Um, I'll show you in a minute. Um, it's kind of a hard gray sometimes to match up, especially with hats, but I'll, I'll, I'll go over that in a minute. As far as how the shoe looks, I like the shoe. Um, it's got a, you know, it's got a, you know, of course it's got, you got your new buck, new buck here, nice multi-grain leather here where the whiskers are, and it's a light multi-grain here on the toe box. Uh, they also got a little bit of gray here in the stitches here, which tries to bring back some of that Atmosphere Gray in the from the side panels, but um, yeah, the shoe looks nice. It's a clean looking shoe. There's not, I mean, it's not like a, a big pow shoe, but I feel what I think it, what helps the shoe a lot um, is almost this like, this, this black um, here, because you know, the black inside here, you see a little bit of it, but you see a little bit more of it here, and it's a little bit on the bottom. It just kind of gives it a little bit more outline pop. I think it helps the shoe a lot, just to not to fade out too much, kind of keeps the colors intact, but um, yeah, but it's, it's nice, nice clean shoe. Um, it's definitely, a gray you have to you know, watch out for is when you when you when you match up with it, and I'll show you. So again, I'll show that show you that later. But uh, just to go over the bottom here, it's your carbon fiber plate. You got your little hologram there with the jump man, uh, black and white and the gray. Uh, and there's like I said, there's a hologram there with um, I don't have my glasses. I don't think it yet. It's got the um, the 23 in there as well. Uh, you got to also back here in the here. You have got the Roman numeral a tw yeah, for 13 right there. Uh, got a black jump man right there on the tongue. Let's see what you got inside here. Okay, they got the red jump man inside right there. Yeah, so like I guess this is definitely a clean looking shoe. I mean, I like it. Um, like I said, maybe it's a little, a little bit more of a heavier on the black scene just to keep it more controlled with the color so it doesn't run off on itself. But it's nice. Like I said, um, I think it's a clean looking shoe and it's something to have, you know, in your wardrobe. They haven't made this colorway before, not this, this exact combination, especially with this atmosphere gray. Nike's going, Nike Jordan brand, they're going a lot into the, um, the colors of, um, like earth tones and metals and stuff like that. So, you know, atmosphere gray, that's why you, you see this gray. It's a different kind of gray. So they're trying to get, they're trying to pick up different themes from different things from nature. Um, so I guess that's where all this is coming from. But uh, yeah, I guess it's a cool looking shoe. Clean. Um, the hats, I kind of went crazy really trying to match a hat with that gray. It was kind of going all over the place. Um, this is just a Nike hat like that to match it. That actually matched the best. Um, I, that's put up here a black and white Long Island hat. But I think, as you can see, like how that black kind of picks up that black inside that um, in the tongue area there. I think it pops nice, but um, yeah, the grays, that atmosphere gray is a, is a different color gray. It's, 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 you have to be careful with it, match it up right. When you match it up right, I think it looks, real, it looks really nice. It's different, it's a different gray. So, um, yeah, so that's that. Let me show you, they have, we got one, uh, one sweatshirt in that goes with it. They put some red in there. And of course, there's a little bit red here on the bottom of the shoe, but that doesn't really help when it's on there, but it's nice, nice sweatshirt. Um, was it was eight, yeah, $80. It picks up that is the right color gray uh, for it and the right tonal, so that looks nice. Uh, and maybe they put this in here just to try to give it a little more of a, of a splash with that red in there. But um, like I said, it's a clean looking shoe. Just just be careful with the gray. Make sure it's, it hits right. You got to really be with the shoe to match up to your clothing um, with that gray. Um, but um, yeah, cool looking shoe. Uh, let's see what we got here. A lot of shoes up here. If I can remember them all. This Air Max uh, 95. These are 160. The blue, white, with a little black. It's a little different take on that. How they introduced that black on one of the, the uh, waves up here, so it looks pretty cool. I have a nice day pack. This is Air Force One 110. This is a um, 270 at 150. Cool color combinations right there. There's a whole line of these different purples and metals and um, these next four or five shoes here. You got Air Max 90, which is a really nice looking shoe. These are 110. 
uh, you know, it's 270s at 150. Another one here with more of that metallic look on it, right there. These are really cool looking. Um, these are 150 as well. And actually, this this could be 160. These shoes, I think, are a little bit more money because I think even this Air Max 95, I think, is 170, say 160. Yeah, but I, I like how the colors, this metal, futuristic metal look um, on these look pretty cool. So Air Max 95. 160, these are um, 97s, these are 170, and then you got your deluxes here at um, 180. So, again, that's the whole package, looks pretty cool. Again, go back to the metals and, and stuff like that from Nike. Um, looks pretty cool. Here you got some Vapor Max here, that's a black with a green bottom. Um, these are 190, and then you got a flying in Vapor Max there. Uh, a little bit um, more of a yellow tone with the black, these are 190 as well. Uh, $200 for flight posits, Nick, you know, think colors, this is a cool looking shoe. Old throwback shoe, that's cool. Uh, I've showed you the last color is a black and yellow one. This is that Air Saturn 720 with the 720 bottom. It's you know it's got the NASCAR inspired theme. Uh, back here it says race. Uh, can you... Actually, this one does. That's weird. Hmm. Yeah, the other one, the yellow one had racing in it. That, there's a theme uh, for the shoe for these Saturns. Um, they're very very comfortable. This, like I said, this is the all black. So that's that one. On the back, oh, that's right. Yeah, this is the, uh, one of the T-shirts just to kind of show these colors. So they're trying to keep these themes going with the metals and, and stuff like that. So it's pretty cool. Uh, we got a whole line of 720s in the back. These are coming out, uh, I think, next week. Got a black, a gray, a brown, and this green one. This green one has a cool T-shirt to go with it. Uh, I mean, that, that's $35 T-shirts. That looks pretty cool. Something different, new colors. So that's nice. These are Air Max 90s. These are at, these are 120 because they're a little bit more. Um, they got a little knit, knitting going on here on the toe box here on the side panel. We've got three colors: black, navy, and red. So these are these always sell well. These Air Max 90s, especially the solids like that. So uh, yeah, that's it. So it's a nice collection of shoes. A lot of different stuff. Uh, a lot of different themes. Um, so there's your your atmosphere gray Jordan 13s. I guess the next one. Um, I think the next one I'll do is the Tinker 3s. There's a white and red Tinker 3 that we're going to be getting next, so I'll review that one for the next year. So, here's your Jordan 13 Atmospheric. Grays, streak gear out.